Hey beauties, it's me, Wangali with Two Chic Tips. Ah, I know y'all looking like, what in the world is going on with her? But it's a reason for this look. <laughs> you know it's nighttime if I'm doing my hair. I've washed my hair and I thought, hmm, let me come on and show you guys the hairstyle I'm gonna do today. Um, as we know, as we can see, if we don't know, I got my hair cut. I put a poll over there on Instagram going, should I go Bob or should I go Pixie? Or stop somewhere in the middle of that. But it's been really warm. And the humidity has been a hot mess here in Atlanta. So I was thinking, I'm gonna do a curly look. So tonight we are using rods. And I thought, well, let me show y'all how I do it. Right now I have conditioner on, I love conditioner on today. My hair, since I cut it, been feeling a little funny. So I was like, uh, let me just leave the conditioner on for a while. Even though they say after 30 to 40 minutes, there is no extra results, but I ran errands and so, this is what we are doing today. But I'm gonna go ahead and go back in here and I'm gonna rinse this um, conditioner out and then we're gonna get started. But yep, so I fell somewhere in between that hairstyle. So we'll see, we're gonna see how long this lasts. Still think the top is a little too long for me, but you know, I got time. I'll just work with this for a little while and see how I like it. And if I don't, we know I can cut it down some more or I can just wait and wait, let it grow some more. But yeah, this is where we at now. And I am loving it. Now, I'm going to tell you what I love most about a shortcut now that I have, you know, grayed out and everything is my hair is whiter at the root. So the shorter I go, the whiter my hair is. And I really like that. Oh yeah, but this is where we are right now. I'll be right back. This part of the video is sponsored by Merit. I was contacted by Merit and asked if I would like to pick out a few of their products. And I was like, mm, don't know much about Merit. Let me pull up some little information on them. So I found out that they were clean, vegan, and cruelty-free. I said, yeah, I'm gonna give them a try. Well, let's first talk about this. This little cute makeup bag that you get with your purchase. Is this not the cutest bag? And the color is hot. <laughs> but oh, you just tie it right in and you have a makeup bag. And you get this with your purchase. Now these complexion sticks are wonderful. I have been using the makeup now for a month. I would say it has been a month. I like the thing is less is more. So this is the complexion sticks. And here are the colors. I already did the swatches. This is amber and this is buff. Now it is beautiful. I have it on today. I love it. It's easy, it melts into my skin. I'm telling you, it looks like my skin. Now with that, I also picked up shade sticks. And this one is Sangria. And this one is Pink Beet. And this is what they look like here and I am wearing pink beat today now these are not long lasting I'm not gonna tell you that but uh, everyday lip oil they are great and that's what I have on today I also picked up bounce and this is a highlighting balm so this is the color here and this is it right here I also picked up a brow product. This helps with um, 
thickening them up. Just giving you a little thickness on your brows. The color I have is black brown. In the description box, I will have a link for you down there and it has a discount code. So definitely check them out. And I'm telling you, I must say, I am enjoying it. I will definitely be trying more of the products. Now, for the makeup, I've only seen that they have seven products, but seven products are all you need to have a complete look and to have a everyday makeup look where you, you look like you, but a better enhance you. So thank you to Merit for sponsoring today's video. And let's get into the hair for today. Okay, I'm back. I've rinsed out my conditioner. And I hope the lighting is okay in this video because um, I'm just using a vanity overhead light. Um, in case you didn't know, I had a flood. A lot of my equipment has gotten damaged. And so right now I'm making the best of what I can with what I have now. So I'm in the bathroom where there's holes up in the ceiling. Uh, let, me see, let me see if you can see it. So yeah, so that's one of the holes. <laughs> so, I just cleaned it out and tried to make them. I gotta do some videos, I gotta do something. So work with me here you guys. You know, I'm sorry about the lighting if it's a little darker and stuff, but we're gonna make we're gonna work with this. We're gonna make it happen and stuff. So I did wash my hair already, and like I said, I just rinsed out the um, conditioner, and I went back to my trusties. I was using the Nexus, and this is the Clean and Pure line. So I went back to this. This is the shampoo, and then this is the conditioner. So I've done that, and I'm about to put in the leave-in conditioner in, which is going to be my all-time favorite, Carol's Daughter. And I am going to put a little oil on my hair, which I'll be using this starting on, on my hair. So let's begin then. So this is my hair now that we have rinsed that out. And I am loving it. Loving it being shorter, but this um, Atlanta humidity right now, and I think I, it's messing with me too because I ain't got out of the hands of the work with the short hair. So let's do this. So we're going to work with the shorter part. And you know what? I didn't get my my mousse. Be right back. Um, right now, I think I have like three rolls left. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this with you guys. So here we go. Now, my number one tip would be to tell you guys to roll your hair in the direction you want it to go. And when I say that, and I let my hair dry, I like it better when my hair is dry. And then I add the the um, styling mousse onto it. But if you ride, and when I say roll it in a direction, I kind of want this to stand up some in the top. So what I'm gonna do is roll it and twist it. Oh, you can't see it. I'm sorry, I'm too tall. I'm gonna roll it. And as I roll it, I'm gonna, see, I'm gonna twist the roller and try to stick it in between somewhere so the curls can go kind of like to the top and hopefully flare out that roller went that way this one gonna go this way or this one went this way and then so on so just try to make the curls um different don't have them all uniform this way, so I'm gonna start down at the bottom and I'm gonna roll it and twist it 
you can tell how I was full of skin. Now, what I want to say is I took my time. I did the shorter ones. And as you go, graduate to the longer part of your hair, your rollers will get bigger and bigger. Now, I did have my pink ones, which are a tinge smaller than the orange ones. But I kind of want the top of my hair to be more bouncier than tightly curled. So I'm hoping I. So, and as you go along, I would always also say, use a mirror. For me, I'm a feel along person. And then in the end, I use the mirror to see if I missed anything. So let's check and see if I missed anything. Well, I took my time. Now right here, I probably should have made that another row right across there, but. So that's where we are. And what's gonna keep it in place? Hmm. What's gonna keep it in place is gonna be my scarf. So hold on. Let me get my scarf and tie my hair down. Okay, I'm back, beauties. I went and got my scarf. And I'm going to show you I went on ahead and changed out these two right here. So. Now, this hairstyle is definitely a great type of... Um, I don't have to be up under hair dryer. So, that's one... This is a straight, no-heat hairstyle. Especially if you go to bed. Now it depends on the length of your hair and how thick your hair is or how long it's going to take it to air dry. But I do mine at night, roll it up, and in the morning, I'm pretty much dry. If I'm not, I can sit up on the hair dryer maybe 30 minutes, just probably 30 minutes, not more than that. So this is how I'm going to tie my hair up. This is the scarf I wrap my hair with. So this is what's going to keep it, keep my rollers, the small ones in place. And for me, it doesn't bother my head to um, sleep on these, but they are hard. So I don't know if they will bother you. Okay. So, you know, got to get my mirror so I can see, so I can show you this is the back. Those are the rolls, as you see. So this is how we're going to go to bed tonight. And I'm going to wash my face. And see you on the flip side. See you in the morning. Well, good morning, beauties. I'm back for the takedown. So let's begin this. Now, if you hear anything with a little hum to it, sorry. That is my fan. It is warm in here and I open up the, the drape so I can get a little of the natural sunlight but it still looks kind of dark but I hope it's okay the lighting but here we go so like I said for me you see that just slid out because that was on nothing hold on let me move some of this stuff I got in my way so I can take these rollers out but you will just begin to do the takedown of the rollers. Now, the reason I use these papers, like I said, is to grip the shorter hair, but at the same time, it takes, and I know I'm all over my head taking this stuff down, <laughs> but I wanted to talk to you guys too. But um, I use it so it can, I can grip the shorter part of my hair, the shortest part of my hair. And I use it too, it helps with the freest factor. Now what I love about this hairstyle is, it's a good five there and the, old, the longer you wear it, the better it looks, the older it gets, oh yes. the rollers out. Let me come in and just show you what it's looking like. Bam! That's it. Right there. Now as um, 
I take it down, I usually use an oil with this. So I'm going to use this lighting oil with this. And I'm just going to actually just put it on my hands and rub it through my hair. And this is a good hairstyle in case you have dry, a dry scalp for you to be able to um, just part your hair and put oil on your scalp. Let's see what I'm working with. Okay. And now you just have to do, you know, where you got a space in between and stuff. And that's just from the roller. Okay, I thought I would come to the window so I could show you better my look in natural light. So, makeup look is gorgeous. Well, beauties, I hope you all enjoyed the video for today, this short curly hair video, and hope you're enjoying the look. You really like the look of it. And I would like to thank Merit for today's face. If you have not heard of Merit or have not tried them, I'll tell you ought to try them. Now, I will have a discount code in the link right down here in the description box. So take time to go and peruse their um, website. But I tell you, this is a nice minimal look. Now I put a little bit more emphasis on my eyes, but it is pretty much my minimal look. Is it not beautiful? Yes. Oh, nice, soft, glowy. The makeup, love it. So, yeah. Well, guys, thank you so much for stopping by today, spending time with me. And if you're not subscribed, what could you possibly be waiting on? Tell me, what could you possibly be waiting on? Go ahead, subscribe, and share me, and comment in the comment section. And don't forget, I know I'm asking you to do quite a bit. Go ahead, click the like button. That really helps me out on my channel. Well, guys, I thank you again. I look forward to seeing you in the next one. Bye-bye.